the Competitive Edge Sports Ambassador Programme is a collection of athletes from Norfolk who go around to schools and presentations, talking to the kids, inspiring them, giving them some advice and generally involving the children in sport. The, the project is inspired for the 2012 Games by getting kids involved and active in sport and bringing the awareness of the Olympic and Paralympic Games to them. Some of the kids might not have experienced it before and it's a great opportunity to, to, bring, to bring it home to them. Being involved in the project has made a huge difference to me. It's given me more confidence to talk in groups of, of people and to share my story. It's also inspirational to see the responses of some of the children I work with and the adults and get something back from them and, and share my experiences with them. To have an impact on someone's life is incredible. It's, I think it's the, the key thing in life generally. If you, can, if you can impact someone else with what you do or what you know, I think you, you've made a great achievement. I think the 2012 Games being on home soil is incredibly inspiring. It's a great opportunity as an athlete to represent my country in my country. Um, I think that's going to be one of the most inspirational bits about the Games. And to have the legacy that's going to leave and all the work that's going on in London is incredible to be a part of. It's going to be great if we can get kids at this age um, more involved in sport and active in what they do. It's, it's going to be great for later life for them and to get more participation and more interest in sport in general in the UK. We've got the future Olympians and Paralympians of the next 20 years. I think the Competitive Edge project is inspired by the 2012 Games by getting sports people into schools and into environments to inspire the kids to have a go at something and to bring the awareness of the sport to them. Some of the children might not have experienced the Paralympics before an Olympics. Some of them are only four, they haven't seen one before. So to bring the awareness of what's going on and to get them involved actively in a part of it is huge. I enjoy listening to them now because I never knew it was a Paralympic so it allows, allows other people to take part. The thing I most enjoyed about today is hearing Mel talk about what she was doing in the Paralympics and the medals that she won. Mel was great today. Um, I learned that, well, even if you do, have an accident or anything you still go on and she achieved that. Um, in my training I work with four key words those are dream, believe, work, achieve and me and my coach have worked with these I think it's a key message for kids and adults alike you can dream something if you want to do anything you have to dream it to believe it is more tricky if, it, if things don't go right uh, but to keep believing you're going, you're going to do something and you want to do something is crucial. But you put the work in, you put the effort in and then you get the best bit which is the last one achieved. And whether that's a, a medal in the Paralympics or the Olympic Games or passing a test at school or learning to ride a bike, you can achieve anything you want if you try and put your mind to it.